people dead, family members, um, people, kids. People, nah, kids is off limits. Unless, but you know with a family member who's six feet under? They already dead. What can I do? Bye. <laughs> <laughs> oh, did you get corn or no? No, I only got this one's mine. Y'all got seven potatoes. Damn, why are you get so many potatoes? I love potatoes. Oh, let me take this ring off. Hold on. It's a little baby off. Oh, they changed it. Really no, cool. stupid, you're supposed to tie it around your neck. Oh, really? <laughs> <laughs> what is up, you guys? Welcome back to my channel. Welcome to my channel. I'm Deja. Ah, this is a JoJo. Um, today, we are just about to eat. <laughs> Do y'all see the greatness in these bags? Oh my god, hopefully, the crab good and they're not playing with us this go around. It better be good. It better be good. Because we went somewhere else. All right, we about to get into it. We about to just talk for y'all, okay? As you see by the title, it's gonna be a lot going on. Huh. I'm actually kind of mad I didn't get no sausage. Because I wanted it's my potatoes. Spicy. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Why do you get so many potatoes? I love potatoes. We're gonna talk in a minute, huh? Hmm. Yeah, actually, yeah. Mm -hmm. I did that. Y'all probably like, who the hell is JoJo? <laughs> JoJo, who are you? <laughs> <laughs> How do we get into that? How do we get here? Um, so JoJo is my little cousin's mom. Yeah, yeah, that explains it. Yeah. So, as you know, my cousin and her had a baby together. <laughs> You're very cute. That's how she came to our family. So that's that. Nice to meet you guys. <laughs> Y'all gotta hold on, cause I. I tried not to eat none today just for this. But I tried, I said I tried because I did eat some pop stickers. I had Chick-fil-A earlier. <laughs> I'm not petty. I'm not petty because I don't care that much. <laughs> Do you really have to be cared to like be petty though? You have to care that much? Yes. Mm. What's the other way for you to go out your way to be petty? To be funny. I feel like okay. mm. when people get under my skin or they try to, now I'm gonna really try to mm, just demolish your soul. Like now I'm just gonna get you. She petty, so she got more stories than me. I'm over here trying to think like, mm, do I really be doing anything? I don't think so. Yeah, I don't think I have any petty like nothing. Not like yours. Yours is probably like. Mm. I feel like it's normal. I don't really call it petty. <laughs> I, that. I feel like my pettiness, my pettiness is gonna be like a compared to you. I feel like my pettiness is just like a, oh okay. To you, bitch, because you're crazy. I feel like I'm regular. <laughs> mm -hmm. I've had moment. Let's see. Mm -hmm. Let's see. I, was, I think I was talking to this boy. He did something to anger me. He was talking to one girl or something. So I was like, all right. But he's trying to play me for a dummy. Mm -hmm. like That's how I be, though. Play like it's stupid. I'm the wrong one to play with because now I'm just. Oh, you got an older brother? <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah. You mess with his older brother? I didn't mess with anything. I just had him eat my coochie. <gasps> now we're even. We're fine, and he enjoyed it. That's all he getting out of that. That's how you, that's how you work that. You never give up too much. Just your pleasure. Don't give them pleasure. The older brother? Yeah, why not? Did the dude find out? I told him. Oh, what did he say? He wanted to. Mm-hmm. Did he? No. <laughs> but I'm just saying. Mm. Cause why would you play with me like that? Mm. The older brother was cute too. He was looked at to go for him first. I should have went for him first. You know they said like. You look at the See friend, everybody in the home group and you like that. You know what? <laughs> I should pick you first. But I see you. you know what? It's like that, but for me, it's always been I got the cutest friend. Damn, for real? Yeah. Let me think. Hold on. Mm. Mm, yeah, I think I got the ugly friend. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I, yeah, like, no. I like semi ugly people, but then again, they was like top dogs. But then again, I like gang members. So when you see me, you like, damn. Why did I see the whole group? I ain't never before felt that. I see you. But I've never felt like that. I have. Because then they be by themselves. Like, show me all your friends. Right. They don't like to bring around all their friends. That's because they know they be ugly. That's, that's, that's stingy, don't you think? I, yeah. I think that's very stingy. Yeah, I feel like you should, um. Show me your friends. Show me your friends. <laughs> <laughs> Let me see who you hang with. Right. Um, I don't think I'm that petty. I'm going to get too deep into pettiness. It's like. I haven't went out my way to like, oh, I'm about to. You know, I've never went out my way to do it. I'm trying to think. I used to. I don't do it no more now. I just let everything play out. Mm. But then again, I'm a Scorpio. Mm -hmm. I'm very vengeful. Okay, Patty, let's see. Tell me if you decide, like, this is Patty. All right. I was messing with this dude. Found out he had a girlfriend. But 
the dude knew I did like YouTube and stuff, right? Mm -hmm. So I'll be vlogging and hanging out and posting and da da da. Turns out I knew that the girlfriend's close friend has been a fan of me for years. Mm, okay. It was the girl, the, the friend had told me. It was to a point where I did not care and I had uploaded videos and parts you can see the man's in the video and i guess the friend because you know they fan they go watch yeah they is told the girlfriend and you know that had happened that's not i mean i knew but it, it could be a chance of getting back yeah i didn't care but i don't think you was intentionally trying to be like no he asked me to delete it and i said no right but because at that point it was already up there yeah it's not no close friend story all right it's not instagram this is the world. Okay, it's already going viral. Right. Yeah, no, that's not. This is my job. I'm going to post it, make my money. Oh well, I don't think that would really be. That's petty. not petty. I felt like you were having fun, enjoying yourself. Like I said, it's regular. Mm-hmm. Like petty would be your intention. I send the link. I send the link to her. That was petty, y'all. I didn't do that. Maybe you should. Maybe I should. Probably should have, but I didn't. Like here, click my link. <laughs> Subscribe. <laughs> that's petty. Were you petty in high school? Girl, no. It's crazy. I was a little dumb in high school. A little dumb. Mm hmm I think we all were dumb. Mm -hmm. Like somewhat, but we got Dumb and in love. I was just stupid. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I, I think I didn't turn dumb in love until my sophomore year too. Mm -hmm. what, year, what year was that for you? Dumb and in love? Mm -hmm. Freshman year. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, I used to start off dumb and in love. Damn, we just With got my high first school. boyfriend. Dumb and Damn, in love. Damn, you couldn't wait until sophomore year? I tried. You just go into freshman year like that. Be lit. <laughs> I never had a chance to be lit and hang out. Oh. I was always like in the house type of kid. I wonder what they say about you now. Oh, that I'll be wallet? Yeah. <laughs> I don't give a fuck what nobody got to say. I'm grown. <laughs> it is. I'll be having fun. 25. All right. <laughs> you know, but petty, petty in high school? Mm. Yeah. I would say probably after high school. After? See what it is with me? Okay, listen. Y'all, because the, the little stories I got, they don't be on my behalf. I'm not a homewrecker. Okay? It's just a fact. So you just walk in the door and sit on the couch? If you leave your front door open and they invite at you your in. apartment, right, he invites you in. And you tell me to come sit down and get comfortable. I'm going to come sit down. I'm going to get comfortable. comfortable. Right. Because you don't care, I don't care. Right. Right. You invited me in. Right. You don't care. No, to my feet up. Mm hmm. So I was talking to this dude. He had a girlfriend. Okay. Okay? Mm. First, it wasn't like girlfriend, girlfriend. Why are you still talking to me if you got a girlfriend? You don't care? I don't care. So, but, you know, like back then, my days, um, I was very, uh, fuck the world. Okay? That's the type of time I was on. So, I don't care about your feelings, sweetheart. I'm sorry. I'm a new person today. I'm gonna do it. Okay, Zoo played football. After his football game, um, you know, I was always invited to his house. Like, you know, mom loved me. Uh -huh. I can come whenever, spend the night whenever I wanted. Period. So, um, after the football game, I mean, I didn't tell. Ooh. I never had to tell him I was showing up, you know? Right. Me and my friends kind of just went over there. Mm -hmm. We walk in the house. First of all, I'm kind of already intoxicated off the um, flower. <laughs> <laughs> and I walk in the house and I like do a, I back up. All my friends behind me try to push me in the house. Mm -hmm. I back up because, I back up because I walk in and I seen this girl sitting on the couch. <laughs> oh. So I'm like, ooh. Okay. Bad timing. How okay, you? but at this point, I'm already here. I'm not gonna drive home because I'm a little high. So I'm gonna go to sleep. So you just gonna sit there, see her. Girl, I walked in the house. Where'd you sleep at? At his house. No, where? In the room. In his room? Listen to the story. <laughs> so I walk in the house. Like I said, the mom loved me. Mm -hmm. Walked in the house, the girl's sitting on the couch. At that point, I don't know how long she's been there. All I know is, you gotta go home sometime because I'm not going home. So I walk in the house, sit down. His mom comes out, you know. We're all sitting down on the couch. At this point, she's like on a different couch than him. And I guess she was feeling a little intimidated, so she got up and moved. But when she got up and moved, the mom was like, you ain't gotta do all that. Right? So I'm like, okay. Listen to his mom, sweetheart, you ain't gotta do all that. So then, I'm sitting there, we're like, we're all having a conversation. Well, not all, but me and my friend and his mom were having a conversation. Mm -hmm. The living room kind of spacious, so they sitting over there on that couch. I'm talking, like I told you, I'm high. So I'm like falling asleep. <clears throat> the mom gets up and grabs me a blanket. Okay. While I'm just like laying on the couch talking. So she gives me a blanket. 
at this point, everybody know I'm not going nowhere. The girl, I guess, the girl mom come or whatever. Mm -hmm. And uh, she like say, oh, like her mom's outside. This oh, nigga okay. was like, okay. Right? Nigga didn't want to get up and walk her out, nothing. But her mom was there and she sat in the house for a good 45 minutes. I don't know if she was thinking that I was going to leave first. But like she didn't want to leave because we were there. Okay. I wasn't going anywhere. Right, I thought we already said a show. Right. When you got so through. she got up, she left, blah, blah, You know, I stayed the night. In the next morning, she called the man's phone. I guess it was a little petty. She called the man's phone, but that night he was already telling me like he don't want to be with this girl, he don't like her, like she crazy, blah, blah, blah. You know how niggas be pillows on here. Uh -huh. She called his phone and he was telling me like, bro, tell her to stop calling me. It's not like anybody else to do it. I answered the phone like stop calling the nigga. That's my thing. Well, he told you to do it. Yeah. So I'm gonna do it. Right. You gotta tell me twice. Right. What we say here for a good time and not a long one. That's not petty though. No, it was petty. Why? Because that was her nigga. But listen, it's more, that was like the end of the, the saga. It, it's the point that you see him, you see me type. You think I'm his cousin? Like, what is what? I'm sorry. You said you got comfortable. You see me at every game, bro. You see us after the game. You see us out. That was steady, dude. Oh, girl. I mean, he told you to do it, bro. Right. So. At that point, he did not care. He didn't care to begin with. No. We knew that. Once you sat down and got comfortable on the couch with a whole blanket. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. She should have established that when she caught the. When the mama told her she ain't got to do all that. Yeah. Mm hmm She should have got it and left. Mm hmm Me? You walking, what the fuck are you doing? I was Ask a them. question. Like, who is this? <laughs> Why are you here? But see, like, hey. I know your peoples. This ain't your peoples. Hey, close mouth don't get fed. Mm -hmm. You ain't got no questions? I ain't got nothing to do with me. Hey. Whatever y'all got going on in your house, hey. That's you, honey. He opened that door, said come in. And get, get cozy. comfortable. Get cozy. Mm -hmm. Prop your feet up. That's what I did. Here's a blanket. And he was fine. Oh, well. That's her fault. So, well, she really crazy though, because definitely if she was crazy, she would have asked, and she would have. If she was crazy, she, she would have been on all ten. If she was work. crazy, we would have been fighting in his mama living room. Right. She didn't have that energy. She wasn't so on that type of time. She wasn't time. crazy. She wasn't on that type. She probably was crazy talking to him. Oh. Well, she know. wasn't crazy with that same energy with a female. Mm -mm. I don't have no limit. Mm -hmm. To being funny, so be careful what you do, because I'm coming for you. Hmm. Like what? There's no limit. Like there's nothing is off limits, at all. Hmm. So, hey, I guess feelings gonna be hurt. I'm coming. I'm coming. But like out your way to be petty. What have you done? Mmm. Other than petty. The I talk petty. I feel like. Mm, oh, my ex cousins. <laughs> what? My ex cousins. Mm-hmm. I don't call them cousins no more. They're my ex cousins. Right. You know, you got ex boyfriends, ex girlfriends. Mm -hmm. you cut them off. They're my ex cousins. That's mm -hmm. it. <laughs> what happened? Because now I want to know. And saying, they want to know too. What happened? Nah, because we was getting into it. Mm -hmm. She was talking to my mama crazy. Mm -hmm. I was talking crazy. Mm -hmm. I call her mama a fake Christian. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's a lot of those out there. And we ain't going to speak about that one. We're not going to speak about that one. And then we ain't gonna talk about the fake Christians, but anyway. My cousin was coming in, talking about my mama. Mm -hmm. But then like, her people, she, she shouldn't have said nothing. I had to stop there. My mama told me to stop. Cause she was like, oh, I hope whatever the devil is telling you to do, you need to not listen to my mama. But I gotta tell this cause I can't tell y'all that. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't say that though. But that would've been wrong with me, right? Yeah. I told you nothing is off limits. That's not petty. That's just um. Uh, just be careful what you say, cause I told you nothing is off that's limits. That's just no heart. <laughs> that's just I don't give up. <laughs> that's just I'm just trying to be evil and hurt your feelings. But you're trying. You. I feel like my mother is that. That's my heart. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna war behind that woman. Right. So if anybody step into her like they won't smoke, oh I'm coming. You gonna get it. singing? Mm -hmm. I feel like the ultimate petty is probably like mess with somebody. And then you go mess with his daddy? Oh, yeah, I want to do that. Why? I want to try that one day. Why? That's, that's my boyfriend. Um, cuz. What? <laughs> I'm gonna just shut up. Head on swivel. 
But I changed it. I feel like oh, I feel me, like I would do it. I would do that. Oh, I would me. do it. If, if you, they had a fine ass daddy. No, if you do something to that extent for me to have to want to go mess with your daddy, I'm gonna do it. Or if you got like a big homie you look up to. Yeah. I'm on your big homie. Easy. They're ready. Easy. Ready to pop. Men are so easy. <laughs> Easy. They're easy as hell. As fuck. They think we're easy, but like they're dead ass ready to just throw it on you. Yeah. And then all you gotta do, if you want somebody, is just DM them. Literally. The niggas are gonna be like, oh my god. Oh yeah. Get yeah. that shit. Yeah. yeah. But I don't even want your Venus. They're like, gonna be like, oh, I'm not used to girls hitting me up first. Yeah. Boy, watch yeah. this. About two. That really just ate. I hate that word. Ugh. What are you gonna say, cat? Vagina. Vagina. Vagina sounds better. Yes. The logical term? Okay, well, I don't like that word. Okay, that's that's like, what's word that just Coochie. gets you like, hmm? It used to be cool. Ugh! I, I hate that word. It really used to be cool. Okay, but, we did it! Dang! <laughs> and then we just used to make up it. Bro! We get it. What about punani? Sure, anything punani? other than. Yeah. You like punani? I'm like, I think it's that word. I think uh, I'm like punani. That's it. No. I say vagina. vagina. Yeah, vagina, logical term. Yeah. I mean, on oh, YouTube, you can't really say pussy, but you know. Oh, well. The Uzi. Vagina? The Uzi. The I mean, you're gonna eat the Uzi, right? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, too. Yeah, that's yeah. good. Damn. More petty emails? I'm trying to think. I don't know if petty emails. Petty with females? Mm mm. Yeah. I ain't got time for that because I'll slap you fast. Mm. I'm not gonna go tip for tat. I don't really tip for tat with females. Let me see. No. Oh. I don't think it's petty. I'm more honest than anything. But don't ask me if you're not ready to handle. Right. It's just you don't care. No. Well, I don't care. But why though? What are you gonna do? Kill them? They might. You are crazy. Hey. If that's written. <laughs> <laughs> As the Lord said, it's my time. It's my time. It's what my can time. I do? I'll be, he made me be honest, so shit. Don't ask me nothing. Don't be like you talking to so and so. Don't argue what I'm doing. Come and tell you. But females, on the other hand, I'm not gonna argue with. No I don't really, nobody. I don't really argue with females. I just feel like don't be funny, cause you're not gonna like what I'm gonna do. Yeah, you be funny and I'll be ha ha comedian. You <laughs> trying to be funny? Babes. Oh, I'm about to break you your take heart. There. You better hope I don't know nothing, cause I'm gonna find out. Yeah, I'm coming below the belt. Like I said, that's nothing off limits. I mean, for me, off limits is like people dead. Oh, that's family members. Like, you want to know? People, dead family members, um, people, kids. People, nah, kids is off limits. In but you want a family member who's six feet under? They already dead. What can I do? Bye. <laughs> <laughs> we can't bring them back. The, okay. Not like Jesus. That. Sorry, God forgive me, but honestly, we can't bring. They're already dead. I'm not right. gonna be like. And you talk about, it's only if you talk about my dead relatives though. Now you talk about mine, I'm coming for yours. Okay, that's different. Off the triple, yeah. I'm not finna just straight up and be like. But I feel like you would just straight up. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like you the type to just straight up. It depends, it depends on our, uh, the argument. And how like strongly and passionate I feel the argument is about or like what we're talking about. Then I'll be like, okay, bitch, you trying me. But all right. Like coming. if you got But I wouldn't come for nobody kids though. Unless you come for my kids. But even still, I probably still won't come for your kids because kids are just off the limits. The kids don't do nothing. But don't do too much though. Because <laughs> if your kid looks slow, then I'm gonna tell you. But don't come for my, it depends. Like, I don't know, I'm very passionate about my kids. So don't do too much. Oh, you come for my kid? I'm not talking nothing to you. I will go to jail yeah, and, and smile in my mugshot happily. Turn. Happily, what you do? <laughs> Turn. <laughs> what the girl of Medea said? I'm in jail. Because I murdered 18, 18 men. men. She said what? You did what to ATM? I murdered, murdered 18 men. Shut I'm here to like, die. <laughs> yeah, I'll be in there to like, die. You talk about my kid? Yeah, no. Yeah, no. Mm. That's, that, that, that is crazy. Don't think that's you know, that's actually how I got into my first fight in high school. Really? Yeah. I mean, then I didn't have no kids, but the day before, the girl wanted to uh, be on Facebook trying to be funny and talk about my you. nephew. Oh. And at that time, my nephew was like my child. Oh yeah, that was your baby. Yeah, that was my baby. Oh, okay. Yeah. There's no point with you. So at school tomorrow, you're gonna give me that. I'm sorry. So yeah, that's what happened. And you straight to fight. Yeah, that's when I started fighting. After that, I got suspended like six times that year. Oh, Nana, I'm so sorry. I mean, it happened. I'm growing at this time. But yeah, that was the first time I got suspended. And after that, I was suspended like seven times that year. 
Oh, okay. Seven. Yeah. More than one. Yeah. Numerous occasions. Mm hmm It was bad. Well, mm -hmm. that'll do it. That'll do it. <laughs> they open the gates. That'll do it. That'll do it. I'm going to tell y'all the story. I fought this girl uh, for my first time out here on the strip. Are you serious? Girl, yes. Oh, wait. In the hotel room. Oh, yes. And I left. Oh, she was there. Stupid. So how would I believe? Yes. I was I was Were you there when the girl came, though? No, remember I told you I was telling you I'm about to be on an elevator and I seen her. And you was like, I'm like, wait, this is the girl that's in the elevator? And I just girl. Said, Bro, no, but do you remember when I was telling y'all? I'm like, I don't think I was telling uh, real. I was like, this is not the hotel. Yeah, I'm gonna tell y'all about that story because it was crazy. But it was like, I know what you mean because I had so much built up anger inside of me. Something in my head told me to stop because yeah. I, I was, I, I seen the police officers and I said, I want to go to jail for killing this girl. Right. So I just had to like, I just got up and I just stopped. In this Charlotte, I just walked out. She wasn't little. She was a big bitch. She was. She was she big. Was yes. I seen her. Yes. I was over she get out the elevator, go to the. I'm like, okay, maybe she goes to the bedroom. And I was Why like, you didn't come back? Bro, I was going home. <laughs> I was lit. I was like, oh. Yeah, I'm about to tell y'all about that story. That I was, was crazy. To go. That was crazy. Yeah, I was litty. But see, it was to a point she was being disrespectful. No, I was letting that. it go. Don't disrespect me. I think that would conclude the video. Um, if you enjoyed it, make sure you get a big thumbs up. If you made this far, you're not yet subscribed. Woo! Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Follow me on all my other social media accounts. They are down below. JoJo's Instagram is keeping that up with that Jody. Keep it up with Jody. Yeah, you'll see me. I'm tagged somewhere. You'll see stores. me, right? She's always with me. And on that note, bye. Bye.